You see, they knew what it was like to be in England. They knew what it was like to be under the rule of the kings and queens. But they had a little bit of freedom here now that gave them a new destiny, a new purpose, a new sense of being. And it became for them their manifest destiny. So I feel tonight we are in a place through our E factor, our eternal, everlasting Father, to reach our manifest destiny. A place that we all know exists because we heard about it before. See, myself, I heard about this manifest destiny place from my grandmothers and my grandfather down at a place called Plains, Georgia. There was this place, a church called Lebanon Baptist Church, right? And every Sunday, they would get together, they would sing, they would praise, and have a good time fellowshipping with the Lord. What they gave me was a destiny. See, I knew at an early age that I couldn't be what the world wanted me to be. I couldn't be what the world said I was supposed to be. Because I, if I did follow that path, I probably wouldn't be in a day.